<coughs> so, the reason why this is uh, paused here is because some of the, uh, well, I'm going to be talking over the, basically, the video. So, yeah, just enjoy that. Uh, I do, something was wrong with the audio, but I fixed it. So, if you like, or, yeah, I'll just talk over this thing, and, I haven't really done this before, but it's something new for me, but I'll be explaining what happened, and what I do, and stuff, and I'll probably do one of these after I finish Half-Life Alex, which is, like, one more episode away, the Dark Souls 3 video is being uploaded right now, um, I'm uploading it to YouTube right now, which will take some time. So, yeah, basically, I'll, I'll just be talking over this, so, uh, yeah. When I went to this location, I really hate these puzzles so much, so... I guess we can start off with something like this. After, like, two tries or something, I managed to get it open. I found some ammo in there, and then I went to look at the, what they were doing to the ant lines. It's pretty weird. Then I tried looking for some exits or doors, but then I found this ladder here. This ladder led me to an area full of tanker ant lines, which are ant lines where they can spit up some stuff. I found some more ammo and some grenades. As the ant lines kept spitting at me, I, I had to avoid their fire stuff. Actually, no, I didn't mean it like that. I, no, 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 I, I killed some, uh, well, I didn't kill some. I threw some grenades that missed horribly. Yeah. As I'm loading my gun, I try shooting the ant lines, but I get hit. After the zombie finally awakes from his well, nice. But I put him to sleep, back to sleep again. I, t I pick up a grenade and attempt to throw it at the ant lion. However, that doesn't hit, so I grab the last grenade, and this is my last attempt to get a good attack. I threw it inside the window, and I'm not sure if it exploded or not. However, I think it did. I don't know. After an uh, amazing game of hide and seek with the ant lion, or I don't know, after a bit of uh, cat and mouse with the ant lion, that's better to say. Um, I actually finally tried to get. I killed one of the ant lions successfully. The other one was a little pain to kill, but I finally did it! Hooray! No. Oh, wait, there was one ant lion left. I'll just take care of him. One swift, maybe not one, but okay, yeah, one. I cracked this lever. I didn't know what it did at first, so I need to get past there. Then I realized that it, it created a little bridge of some sort. And getting across was no problem. I just have to crank it slowly. And slow. I then crossed the bridge, or the container bridge, and climbed into the window. There's nothing here at first except dead ant lions and some ammo. But I went, I went to the other room. I looked outside the window to see if there's anything hiding there. Yeah, I, 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 okay. I really like the combined pulse SMG. I think it's really good. I mean, the shotgun's really good too because it's a blast thing, one hit maybe. I find this healing thing. Yeah. Not really important. After I try, I attempt to pick up this resin, but I can't pick it up since it's on the other side or stuck inside the gate. Then I go down the ladder and I see hell on earth. A lot of explosives. Yes, I know. Since there is no way I could get past those things, I had to think of something really smart. Something to 
use my big brain. I went back up to see if I could find anything else. I see the resin. I try to pick it up again, but you know, it's stuck. So, I went back up and I went back down the ladder. See if I can find anything. And for now, I didn't. I looked around the room to see if there was anything I could do or something, but no, I didn't find anything. And then I saw this thing, push to mantle, push and hold while moving. I didn't know what it means, uh, but if anyone knows what it means, can you please let me know in the comments. I took my gun out to see if I could find anything, but then, as I look up, well, not yet, but when I actually do look up, I will see something. Moments of confusion. I didn't know what to do until I saw the lock up there. I shot the lock, opening up the door, climbed back up, and then boom, there you go. You have everything there. I could have not went get in the resin. I could have either tripped the bomb system or I could have shot one of the barrels. I did this carefully. To not act, to not accidentally kill myself, because you know how explosives are. Perfect. Ooh, I'm going down here. Sorry for the massive rip. I looked around the room. I found some ammo. Everything was okay here, and I just turned the headset a bit. But then I come across one of my least favorite enemies. No, not the zombie. Or that headcrab. But that guy. The armored headcrab. I mean, I personally don't like it because you have to shoot the red glowing thing on its stomach. Uh, that's the only thing I really dislike about it. And, yeah. This next part was a bit weird because there was a barnacle there. You remember when I had 30 resin? What happened to that one resin? 29. Fine on resin. I don't know. Now I tried to I attempted to get this resin, but it got snatched by a barnacle. I quickly and immediately had to kill him. He dropped my resin, which was nice. Uh, the other barnacles were not much of a deal, really. They just were in the way. That guy had a thing, healing bug, or an antlion crow, which I recently found out while doing school. I know it's a bit weird. Now, this door, this area was a real pain. It was a real pain. I really did not like this area. As you can see, it's a battle area. But with what's gonna be in the area? I don't know, I guessed. Combine, antlions, as you can see. Well, when I got to the area, I immediately heard this. Of course. It's not odd, it's a, uh, aliens were only introduced in the second, or the chapter eight captivity, but that's not just one alien. After I, you know, climbed the, I heard this start playing. Right here, I can see the couple. Fireworks! I'm not sure if it was this part I disliked, but I remember dying a couple times. I think it was last... No, I don't really remember if it was last episode of half Life Alex. But I remember somewhere over here, I kept dying. I'm not sure if it was this, this episode. Oh yeah, I actually sniped him uh, a combine symbol. I don't know, I think I did. Yeah, I did. I don't remember. I'll have to rewatch some uh, the video. I'll rewatch it right now as we speak. So, <laughs> all right. So apparently, yes, it was the last video that I had uh, hard times with. But this area, I don't think I had much problems with. But another area that is gonna come. Well, not in there. It's the same area, just at the end over there. Uh, um. Yeah, ant lions are. Oh, they're okay. I, I just. Their walk from Half Life 2 is scary to the end of the 
a bit more dorky in this game. I don't know. Yeah, uh, I really don't know what else to say here. Except just talk a lot. I probably should have made a script for this. I don't know. I'm the idiot to blame. Oh yeah, a guy tried to throw grenades at me. And... Not only did he miss, he was a pretty big idiot. And he started shooting me, and I was ambushed by, uh, antlions. Oh, one of them. Yeah. The guy kept throwing grenades, as there were so many antlions. They kept swarming me for no reason. I don't know, everything just wants to kill me in this game. Uh, they kept walking towards me, so I kept shooting them, you know, you got your own space. A guy attempted to throw a grenade again. I, uh, want, wanted to bait them inside the grenade, the, the grenade's range, so they can get blown up and stuff. It worked pretty fine. They got blown up. Well, they didn't die, but I, f I finished them. I hate it when Combine throw a grenade, I mean... They're just stupid and all. They're pretty cool enemies though. I really like them. Then I finally caught up to, which was I think the most important part about this thing. I had to open a door with three locks as the combine kept throwing grenades at the Thank you, Valve. I really like this. Um, yeah, I had no ammo by this time, so I had to bait the antlion to really good actually I killed him now this was the hardest part he kept throwing grenades there was no more ant lines and I had to basically do this yeah it was not good <laughs> okay so I got really frustrated with this I actually looked up a YouTube video uh, to see how I could connect it and stuff uh, shout out to this guy by the way he had, well I mean, it didn't really help me, I just randomly just did stuff. So yeah, I, uh, I was just really confused and stuff, so I didn't know what to do. Uh, I was a, an idiot and stuff. You know, I'm not that smart. And this is all true, actually. I'm, I'm a quite, I'm quite an idiot. But with doing this, I was very confused. Uh, you know, what so it's like a switch and randomly do it. So what I did, <coughs> sorry, I just try, I attempted to do that, but I didn't know which way push did it. So I was really confused and I just started randomly doing this. And yeah, I just started randomly doing this. I didn't know what I was doing. Da -da 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 -da. I just clicked everything and then I got it. And as you can see, I got an achievement. So, listen, kids, if you want to like do, if you want, if you're having a hard time with this door, just you know, do random stuff. And here we begin the final. Uh, I'm not sure. What are the uh, what are the chapters? It takes a long time. To do this. Uh, come in here. Uh, it was just a room and stuff. I had no more ammo, so I'm like, oh, I'm I'm just screwed. Stuff. I heard some gunshots and some fighting noises, but it was just up there. A dead antlion fell. That was a trap to read my head to get to. And I uh, was with this dark pit. Uh, so I climbed the ladder. I thought I was going to find some combine, but actually I was not. I opened the gate into this place. I... I opened the lockers to see what's inside, you know, there's an ammo bullet, except for my gun, uh, there's a grenade, which I'll hold on to for now, um, there's the bug thing, which I accidentally took out, because I usually keep it in my, uh, left one, because I'm, I'm a right-handed person, so I like to keep that occupied for some reason. I attempted to get this cool jacket off, but apparently physics are really good in this game. Uh, I met uh, a zombie sleeping. Oh, yeah, he was dead already. I thought he was alive. I met him. He was just sleeping after the party happened. I used the healing thing, 
and I realize that there's some Jeff spores over there. Ah, uh, everyone remembers Jeff. Remember how he killed my friend Wilbur? Yeah, he's not alive. He's definitely dead. I hope this was actually... I hope my mic, you guys could have heard me because my mic was away from my face. When I had to cough, you know. Uh, I pick up the resin. I find the tools. And I see a barnacle over there. I'm like, okay, yeah, yeah, let's just try to get that and stuff. Oh, it's a funny story, actually. I was walking on this guy. I got stuck on him. And apparently, this broke my gun. I don't know why. It was just so random. I had to reload my save. Yeah. I need to give this dude payback, so I took my grenade and tossed it at him, and he exploded. However, oh, the head crab is still alive, so I put him out of view here. With a little bang. As he kept jumping towards me, I backed up. I accidentally dropped on my shells. I was in a rush. I hit the, the head crab with my I back up into the hallway. Uh, after I go back in, so we have the head crab was dead. Uh, I thought they, I heard that they came in to pick up and grab it. I don't know. I'm not sure if it worked, but I put the zombie yet. I was busy. I checked if the head crab was still alive. No, it was not alive. And I attempted to pull the head out. I, I checked out the head crab to see if it would work. But nothing really. Uh, going through this area was a little bit of a pain. Because. Yeah, you know, I'll just skip to the part when I actually success. Alright, so here I am here. Um, the Dark Souls video did get uploaded, but the death counter is a little bit. You know, messed up. I'm sorry. I really am sorry, but uh, I'll fix it in the next video, which will be after I upload or finish the second video of Half Life Alex. So, yeah, that will be after. So, conf uh, this was a confusing puzzle I needed to do. I wasn't sure if I needed to move this or move that, whatever the heck I was supposed to do. I, um, I was really confused here, I didn't really know what to do. But then I found this thing here. I didn't know what this thing was until I actually pressed it. And I moved that thing. So hooray. I finally got to move this. I moved that up. up and there you go after an uh after i went back here after an intense battle with the ant tanker antlions i didn't know what to do i they kept shield blocking or something well not well they kept camping or i can't find the word for this but they kept hiding their abdomen so i couldn't shoot them and make them explode i shot one of the legs off and he kept flying. I, sh I killed him. Now it's th just this guy. And I destroyed him too. After I magically teleported through the boards, I climbed up this ladder. And I found what would be... Oh yeah. By the way, that, was, that ammo thing is broken. It's... I don't know what happened to it. It just got like... Remember when I stepped on the zombie? It just got like... It just broke for some reason. I don't know why. I honestly do not know why. And then I encountered our final weapon station in the game. This is the last one. I had 34 res to spare and I didn't know what to use it on. So I used it on the pistol upgrade which stores the bullets and stuff after this confusing puzzle that I'll skip past walked up these stairs, um, 
And I found another zombie with a head crab. And of course I killed him. Now the new gun I think stores bullets or something or does extra damage. I'm not really sure, but this part right here. This area was the worst. Do you wanna know why? Well, I'll tell you why. Yeah, I think you can tell why. And also, I met this annoying suppressor dude thing, man, guy, whatever the heck. And this is a hard time, because the... Did he just say give up, Alex? Anyway, um, I had a hard time with this because I ran out of ammo. I didn't know what to do. He was going to kill me. Blah, 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 blah. Big Junior Donald, Mr. Bugadigadabara, Suga, uh, guy, uh, Fat McDonald, Armored Dude, thing. and, uh, yeah, he kept attacking me, he kept spamming the shield, um, because he was a little baby, and he didn't know how to use his little things, uh, he's, he's just like other guy. He just stands in front of you with his shield! He's like, hey, yo, dude, what's up? Do you want to order the six-piece chicken McNugget from McDonald's and have a happy meal or something? No, that's not that's not like that at all. I went back to see if I could get uh, the healing thing, but it was all dried up and I couldn't use it again. It sucks. Everything sucks. Now, I would like to say this is the least favorite part of my game. Of the least favorite part of my playthrough of Alex. Other than the... Yeah, other than uh, the quarantine zone stuff, like, the chapter 3 is or will be the uh, dark room and stuff. I did not like that at all, but this was probably one of my least favorite areas. Or least favorite fights in the game. Uh, yeah, I ran out of mags. And well, I do have one mag left. Uh, yeah, I picked up the grenade. Now, uh, this grenade could hit or can fail. Oh, I think I picked up uh, another magazine. Yeah, that one right there. Um, you see, uh, this is my last chance. This is my last chance to attack this dude. Uh, this is where it uh, started lagging over there. That's what happened. Now, this is my last chance. Will I get this guy or will I fail? The pens. I don't know. I kept shooting at him blindly. I don't know why. And truck. It's like the same guy, the car guy from uh, Arms Race, the chapter, or the ones labeled Combine Battles are the worst. The same guy says car, and I finally killed him! Yay! I punched him in the face because I hated him so much. I st I pocketed his or I stole his ammo. I tried to jab that thing inside, and now is the worst part. Well, my least favorite part. I kept dying and dying and dying and dying. Once I step through that gate, something happens. After countless of deaths and stuff. Oh yeah, finally the thing works. I don't know why it just broke, and then you're like, okay, yeah, I'm fixed again. Yeah, I died. So so many times going through this area. It was so stupid and annoying. Those man hacks were just. I hate them. I just want to bang my head against my computer desk right now. I was really mad and I just shot them. I didn't want to waste my pulse SMG bullets because there was a. Okay, never mind. I spoke to some. There was a guy, his, uh, there was an APF, also known as a suppressor, the guy, those guys holding the miniguns, you know those guys. Uh, one of those guys was up there. Uh, this is where I go up here and break down the boards. There's a dead guy sleeping, he was, uh, I think a little bit too drunk on the work. Uh, yeah, I met the suppressor. Oh, shit, actually, I met another man hack. He... Tried, attempted to destroy that guy over there, but he failed, so...
after that, I met, yeah, I met the suppressor. He was a big pain. I just really hated them. He was really annoying. He can, he was in my way of doing of doing what I had to do. Now, if you're wondering if the next episode will be like this, no, it will be fully voiced. I will not do this like talk over the recording and stuff. But everything will be fine because I will be doing this. I will be. It will be like the other ones. It will not be my voice over and stuff. I couldn't get across over there, so and I saw this planned out walkway thing over here. I went up it and immediately I saw a combine soldier over there. Now I need to keep it keep it inside because he can shoot me from there. And I think that's what he that's how he that's how he killed me, I see? I hate combine. Actually I really like them, they're cool. After I got a red on him by shooting his gas tank and he he exploded in a he went in a bang and then he fell down. I continue walking through here. I knew there was gonna be so much combined soldiers over here because it's the vault. So of course there's gonna be combine patrolling this area. And as you know I really oh, I don't hate them. I like them. They're just in the game, they're just really annoying. Really, 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 really annoying. That's one of the reasons why I dislike them. They're just annoying. If you get what I mean then yeah, everything's okay. My last mag and I met the combine ordinal over here, the guy that kept and he fell to his death, so that was cool. I managed to get over here and I don't know why I was shooting my gun. I met a dead combine worker and he gave me a med kit. And then I met this, I went to this hallway and I met some more med hacks and combine soldiers. But I think they were easily cut. He was easily cut from his, from the grenade blast. Or not, he was, he was, he still alive. Now, next part here, this is my, this is the next part here. Combine charger would came to me and he was like, yeah, whatever. Uh, I found some shotgun ammo, which I can actually use against him, which was lucky because I ran out of ammo. And then I shot him, and he died. And gravity just, you know, just kind of kept him up because I was out of the end line. Rub things so I couldn't get past. I couldn't get past there, and I just opened this door, and I took a moment to search the area for some ammo and stuff, you know. Since there's no more resin, because he was the last. And yeah, so he he basically defied gravity. I took down his boards. Oh my god, I'm actually tired of this. I just can't wait to uh, edit the last episode. I go into this room where I got really confused. And... I don't know, there's just everything over here. I'm really tired right now. I was really confused and scared, so I'll cut up the part here. Yeah, yeah. So I finally reached the control panel in this room. Well, coming up. So I walked up this vent here, and there, not there, not there, but. Over here, oh god. I'm at the control room. Now, yeah, this is where things get crazy. All right, here we go. 
go. Time to go rescue the savior of humanity. You know, honey, you haven't been doing too bad yourself. Earth could have used you in the seven hour war. Maybe we'd have lasted eight. All right. Looks like the bridge is fully extended. Just need to gently dock the vault to the bridge. How far can that be? Yeah. Oh, God. Okay, well, one of these has to bring in the vault for docking. Right? Right? Well, yeah. Almost certainly. Maybe? No, not that one. Alex, the bridge isn't moving. Why isn't the bridge not moving? I know. Russ, I can see it not moving. This was like totally crazy and stuff. There was so many things going on here. Well, obviously, the destruction is like, yeah, bit really big. Like the whole thing just came crashing down. I'm at a dead Strider. It was deactivated. That is good. And I hope Russell doesn't jinx it. I searched his combine to see if he has any ammo. But no, he's a fugitive, so he doesn't have any ammo on him. I go deeper into this place. I finally found a health kit. I commit mass murder, which... Not mass murder, but I commit a crime by squishing this cute, adorable little guy. And... This was, yeah, just just a little fun. I go down here, uh, into the garage. Catch, I get this grenade, put it inside my slot. Uh, this video is almost over. I can almost publish this video. That's so good. Uh, going down here, I take out my pistol. See what's down here. Uh, you know, there's Kanban here, I attempt to shoot him, I don't get a first shot, and I just go down there and throw the grenade in, but I epically miss, because I have the best aim in VR, you know, you know, I have the best aim. Uh, the combine was dead. I steal his ammo. Then I walk towards uh, this gay thing. Wait, I mean, uh, not, I, I didn't mean to say that. So I hate these. I actually hate these puzzles so much. So yeah, uh, honestly, can't think of anything to say anymore. I attempted to do this puzzle, but then I'm like. Yeah, no, these puzzles are really bad. I don't like them. I attempt to do it again. You know, you know, you know. I see if I can do this. Get whatever inside. And I did it. So, yeah, it's a good thing. Ammo, grenades, you know, all the, all the usual stuff. Shotgun bullets. Um, over here was, I think it was this area, oh, it was a giant hole in the floor, there's a dead combine. I go down here, look, 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 it's fiery pit, and there's, see these two guys here, and they're just having a conversation. And then I ruined their conversation with a grenade. And like, get down, she's here. I think I killed them both. Target locked, dagger on, bouncer out. 
Oh, I'm so tired right now. I can't. I can't. I can't wait for this to be done. I there's a deactivate Strider and rest. Don't jinx it because yeah. Now in this box is some ammo. Yeah, some, wait. Yeah, just one piece of ammo. That's it. And this is where I begin fixing uh, wires operation box thingy thing. I press the button, nothing happens, the elevator doesn't go, boo hoo, woo hoo, cry cry, baby, yeah ba ba ba, ta ba ta, ba ba ba. Um, I go to fix this thing here, and nothing really happens. I don't think I'll add music here because I don't know why. I know my voice is annoying, but hopefully this video is done soon. Uh, I go over here, check back here, I see the elevator, look at, I take a view at the strider, uh, I look at the lift, now, I, there's nothing there, so I need to go through here, I don't know how to open this thing, well, you just pull the pipe or thing there, that's all you need to do. so easy. Now in here, there's the other part. I grab the grenade, uh, not the grenade, but some ammo. <sighs> um, there's more of this stuff here. Uh, you know, some stuff here, and Finally, I can see the end of the video, so we're close. We're close to the end of the video. We're like really, really, really close. And there's something in there. There was a head crab in there. That's a head crab. So I think we have encountered the last head crab in the entire game. He was a good little guy. He didn't live long. Well, he lived quite long. He survived the big damage thing. Little thing. Uh, I go look at here. The health kit there. Some computer plans. I checked out the drawers to see if anything's in there. Because there's going to be that point where you're going to have to scout through drawers. And I tried to open that one, but it kept opening in the middle drawer. Uh, looked over here. Opened that. Gave me some medicine or whatever some shotgun bullets bullets and um everything's okay i gotta go back to the elevator well not the elevator but the ladder here and then i gotta climb up here and here's the lift thing or thingy thing stuff Gotta turn this on here. You gotta pull the switch. And then you go down. Now. This is the end of the video. Oh my god. Uh, see you guys next episode. Goodbye, y'all. And I'll see you guys when we actually finish the next video. Goodbye.